Now the, the, the construction, the outside, is really what we're focusing on, on the building itself. Uh, and then, you know, if, if anybody is familiar with, with uh, the interior of an Orthodox church, uh, they know that it's usually filled with icons and, and a lot of ornate woodworking. Uh, and that will be our next phase. Uh, we, uh, we have some items from the old church that we're going to use, but um, starting uh, in January, we'll make a plan for the interior of the church in terms of iconography. Um, there's uh, the, the icon wall that separates the altar and, and the uh, main body of the church. Uh, and also, you know, sooner or later, we're going to need a church hall. <laughs> so. We'll have to start thinking about that. But uh, our main focus is to get this done, uh, and uh, and then we, we've really kind of uh, we've tried to be uh, be focused <coughs> and not get too ahead of ourselves because we know there's so much more to do. We're going to finish this project without a mortgage, and um, for about 40 church members, that's that's amazing. Uh, we had, of course, we sold the other property to Berkshire Medical Center, who was very good to us. Uh, and, and that helped, that was the seed money for, for this. Um, but uh, our, our parishioners have, uh, have really done everything that they can do to make sure that this happens. And, you know, it's, it's really a miracle. We've had Northern Foundations, uh, who has taken care of, of the parking, the foundation, the sidewalks. Uh, we've had uh, uh, LP Adams has, has, has offered all the supplies, uh, and, and they took care of the roof trusses. Uh, and we've had several local subcontractors with the drywall and the painting. And, uh, you know, they work a lot of extra hours and come in on Saturdays and even Sundays to help us, you know, get it done in a in a way that uh, uh, would suit our needs because we need a place. <laughs> we're, we're without a place right now, so uh, it's uh, they've been great. They've been great, sacrificing a lot of their time uh, and even their family time for the sake of our church. You know. For, for basically strangers, although they're our community, to, to uh, you know pick up and, and help us in that way, you know we can't say enough about it.